Well, it looks like we're going to start to uh, begin our demo trial of dating our great grandmother. Well, it's not our great grandmother, but the comparison can be made because our great grandfather, you know, was there back in the day. So she's as old as that, but it's all right, right? We don't we don't really discriminate. Tinashe is looking real fine. And hey, Mushoku Tensei. Cliff is like dating into the United States. She's a grandma. Why can't we do that here, right? It just happens to be a little bit older. Now, we're coming back to the city, and I'm just gonna assume that the romance between these two will blossom because the main character is such a Giga Chad. How is he a Giga Chad? I think the people here will hate the witch. Usually, back in the day, witches are feared upon, right? So, I'm gonna assume that everyone's gonna discriminate against uh, Tinasha, but our main character will be willing to even let go of his royal title and leave them for her. And that way she realizes, oh, this guy is the real deal. Something along those lines? Let's begin episode two. Farsa's castle, Oscar's residence. Tinasha. Huh? That was about the cur This should negate all external attacks, be they physical or ma So not only does he have the most broken sword, what does that sword do? It's like anti-magic sword. Now he's this resistance towards physical and magical damage. Alright, this guy's busted. Yusha! As long as she remains alive, this spell remains intact. Oh, here, here's the power fantasy part. Poison psychological. Ooh, Tinasha's new drip. Okay, Tinasha the apprentice maid. Secretly a witch. Yes, and this is our one month trial. <laughs> one month dating trial. Here's the difference between sexual harassment and Riz. Because like any other guy, if you don't look this good... Like, if you, like, tell a girl for an entire month, all right, you kidnap her, you bring her home, okay, you're gonna go out with me after this month, bro. It's like, the girls may creep the fuck out, right? In any other context, but because he's so goddamn good looking and confident, it's just Riz now. The past recalled once again. This is not Oscar. Another apprentice? Wait, babies were disappearing? Did the king himself get rid of them? And did an opposition family get rid of them? What the fuck? What? Oh, right, that is Lazar. Yeah, Lazar, the guy that was last episode. I forgot about him. He survived. And this is Sylvia. <laughs> Tinasha, so clutch. Subarashi. Oh my god. No one saw that. No one saw that. Yep, just walk away. Incantationless magic, bro. Wait a fucking second. Wait a fucking second. Are we going to get power fantasy through Tinasha? And Oscar just like around trying to raise and then it's going to like Tinasha's like rise to like, I don't know. And like it's like a magical kingdom, right? So she's going to go to like the academy. There's going to be like a tournament arc and they're going to be like, oh my God, incantationless and shit like that. Hmm? Is it Oscar? Read her fiery guy and ooh. Meredina and General Aris. I don't know, he's probably a good person, but I've just seen too many goddamn red haired dudes with swords recently that's just been a piece of shit, and they're usually like the mob, like the Otome game princes, you know? It's just like every time these this character has been bad, but hey, this time, this guy might be good. Yeah, because Denka got a fucking cracked, broken sword. <laughs> Wait, what's the reaction? Hold on, hold on. Ooh, uh, she didn't seem too uh, impressed there. I don't know. Uh... She's just surprised at her strength. Wait, Tinasha's gonna pick up the sword? Swordsmanship? Wait! Tinasha's gonna beat this General Alice in front of everybody, and then the power fantasy. Let's fucking go. Yo, I didn't realize that Tinasha was the one that's gonna be the hype focus. Yeah. See, witches. Witches are bad here. So, like, when they realize that she's a witch, who knows when the secret will be uncovered, but it's not gonna be good. Okay, those two seem kinda chill. 
They don't look evil or anything. No one's really standing out. And this is our familiar, yes. Uh, Ritora. Really? Ritona approves of Oscar? What? It's not. It's not. Who is it? Oh, it is her. Oh. Yeah, why are you just like that? Oh. Where are you going? The height difference is crazy. I just realized. Magical lake. Demonic beast sealed away 70 years ago. More plot, more lore. Someone is trying to unseal. だったら俺も行く。あそこの事実上の管理はファルサスだ。お前だけの調査では、さすがの俺も国政を動かせん。あなたは腕の立つものを集める。私には、あなた以外を守る義理はないです。承知して。いや、レッ<笑> Are you doing the unsealing of the lake? They're baiting Tinasha. Why are you baiting her? She's looking for him as well. Him. Who is he? She's looking for him. So there's... I'm gonna assume these people are witch related. I don't They know Tinasha, right? This could be a witch and a family. I don't know. Maybe this is one of the witches. Who knows? But... Basically, they're baiting Tinasha out by trying to unseal the lake. Tinasha's eyes all across the world. Because Tinasha is looking for him, which is going to be related to a demon somehow. Hmm, don't know. Don't know. Red dragon familiar. Do we always have that? Do we always have that? Hello. Sylvia is very cute. Hey, where did this dragon come from? Bite! Yo, why the fuck does this girl have her hand on the sword ready to fucking attack right now? What is this? Meridina is literally just looking at us right now with her hand on the fucking sword. Chill! Chill the fuck out! Is she looking for an excuse to attack? You're gonna ride it? Can, can it grow big? It'll change sides. Okay, we're bringing all these people. Alright, she's second in lead. Hmm, the Riz, is it working? Is it- oh, off we go, Tinacho. Whoa, 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 off we go, Tinacho. She heard voices. So, long time ago, somewhere here, Tinacho got teleported away with a bunch of these people a long time ago. Is he one of these people? The he. That Tinasha is apparently looking for. Okay. We're doing some Frida and shit right now. I know I'm back. Yeah, it could be related to it could be it could be related to the great grandpa, yeah. Whoa, 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 come on. No one can be immortal like you! But she obviously won't open her heart to Oscar so easily. She looked kind of sad there, and Oscar kind of realized that maybe. Wait, Tinasha is Frieden? No fucking shot, Tinasha is Frieden. Does, does that voice actor like playing one type of character? Okay, 70 years ago, when the lake got sealed too. Okay, they released the demonic beast onto our country. Demon beast went out of control, killed everything. And then Tinasha saved the day. That's how we need this barrier against the miasma, yeah? Hmm? The two people that we saw earlier. The guy and the girl. No, different voice. Bah! Stop talking like that. So he was there 70 years ago, yeah? Okay. Wait!
Secrets out already. Holy fuck. That was fast. What? I thought we were going to keep our secret a little bit longer, but okay. She already fucking leaked it. Episode two, it's out. It's out. Okay. Not everybody, but the people here know now. And look how they went macho. Tinasha. As in like, they're kind of wary of witches, all right? Like they can't believe that she's a witch because she's so kind. Because they have like a bad understanding of what witches could be. Tinasha, call him bald. Okay. Your master. The guy that released the demon beast? Yo, behead him too. Cut his baldy elf! What has he got cooked up, man? Magic? Summoning? Demons from behind? <laughs> Plus, we have our blessings, right? Ah, shit. Ah, shit. Oh, <laughs> they're dead? No? Let's go, Oscar. He should be fine. That is so fucking busted. Remember, physical and magic attack. So don't do shit to us anywhere. This is the exact thing that Tinasha casted on us. But poison and psychological attacks will still attack us. Meridina saw that. Meridina saw that. Bald. That was an illusion. Yo, what about the people that got actually hit, though? Okay, we got some healing magic. Okay. <laughs> Look at the size difference. Look at her tiny green healing circle. And he's like, all right, step out of the way, kid. Come on, come on, get it, get it. Oh, yeah, this is a big one. This is where the big girls heal, huh? So fast, bro. <laughs> yeah, just a first aid treatment. You would have taken 20 years to do that, so I had to, you know, step in for you. Are they gonna hate her now or what? See how scared they are of Tinashe already because she's a witch? Like how are other people, the fucking royal people, the other boomers gonna act in the in the capital? See, she seems good, right? She'll probably be able to, you know, overcome the prejudice. Yeah, don't feel bad for being scared of me. Are there more baldies? Yeah, she has to date you. A Alone, he says. Wow. We gotta take that burden together. The risk? Oh, was it one year? I thought it was one month. My bad. I thought it was like a contract. I, I thought that she was supposed to be here for only one month, but okay. It was one year that she stays in Farces. Damn. One fucking year? Yeah? I got the weight of something else that's gonna mean something to you later on? But what about beyond the contract? Will you still return to us? I would believe that, but because you just said it, I don't know anymore. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Tinashe might die, guys. <laughs> okay, so he can't get big. And his name is Nark. <laughs> so casually. <laughs> don't jinx yourself like that. What do you mean? You just said you're not gonna die before him, you fucking liar. Okay, more baldies. More baldies. Tinasha, <laughs> Oscar. Cut. Oh, Easy. Easy. Oh, 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 oh. Damn, Tinasha. Show me how scary a witch can be. Here, let me do it for you. What? You're gonna unseal it? <laughs> See how before there was like five different people casting like a magic red circle? <laughs> she just uses one hand. Oh shit, little circles appear. Why is she unsealing it herself right now? Because the seal is almost already done. So it's better to unseal it and kill it, I think. Or is she just flexing for no reason? Alright, here we go. Divine Beast. Is this some kind of wolf monster?
big wolf thing, like a Fenrir. Yo, her eyes are just complete red. Okay, the animation quality went up. Budget's all going in. Oh! <laughs> What the fuck was it? What the fuck was the Tinashi animation? Did you see that shit? Everything just got jacked up. Holy. This whole thing, dude. The fight scenes go crazy. What shit? What was that? I don't know what she's doing. That's what she was doing. A, a basically a bunch of detonating towels and things, I don't know. But the regen, it's too good! Ah, uh, she should have said her eyes. She, she, she should have fucking said her eyes, bro. <laughs> Rise up! Good morning! Another seal time! Another seal, yeah? Oh, she doing a fat incantation. Oh, Lord. Oscar! Oscar gotta show up now. Wait, wait, wait. No, she good? Holy fuck. She, I thought Oscar might like show up and like save her, but no. Tinashe is just fucking hardcore. She just took a fucking chunk out of her stomach. She's like, fuck it, I still do it. I still finish this. The fight scenes, again, dope. The, it's fucking hype. She said that she'd come back. But the injury? Oh shit, the injury. Can you not heal yourself? Wait. Oh, we brought back the big gem thing. The big gem thing was on the uh, the divine monster thing. Hmm. Then what is it then? Yeah, it got bit. So it must be not just like a physical injury, but something else. Like a divine beast like bit her. Now she's cursed. I don't fucking know. She's, she's got some different internal shit going on. And she's up. <laughs> and she's up. Is she naked? Is she naked? Is she naked? She naked. Yes, yeah, she naked. Hello. Which of the other? Yo, her hair is long as fuck. Was her hair always this long? Wait a minute. Uh, I've never seen her hair be tied up. There's got to be some other explanation on why the hair is long. Maybe something to do with the healing that she's been doing. Did she like age herself intentionally to let the healing process go faster? Okay, so accelerated by bodily growth. Like you can just basically make your healing process faster by just making your body grow fast. But you're fucking a witch, so it's it's, it's you're not fucking a witch yet. But she is a witch, so it's like yeah. Offer her your blood. My appearance was due to halting. Wait, wait, did she actually change? Her appearance, did it actually change? Did she get taller? Did she? So far, she looks kind of the same. But my appearance was due to halting my growth. Other than the hair, her body though. Thank you. Yeah, she did. The Riz, is it working? Is it working? Ending time. Post credit scene time. It's the same people for the lake again. Who are these people? And that's the gem that was left behind by the beast, right? I think we already took one home too, didn't we? That's it? What do you fucking mean? What kind of post credit is that? But that's the episode. What? That's fucking troll. I thought there was some dialogue. I was like, oh, at last, our plan has been. You know, fucking executed or something, but they took the gem. Maybe that was the entire plan to get the fucking gem, man. Maybe this is like an important gem. The dragon seems to also have like N Narc, right? Narc seems to be holding on to some like red gem, which I think was on the divine beast's like head, right? I don't know, but that's the episode. So, what did we learn today? Tinashe is fucking cracked, and there's a power fantasy element of Tinashe just like trouncing all these poor kids here because she's just so much more experienced. Tinashe also has some past memories with perhaps the great grandfather of Oscar here. And it's like freedom shit, right? It's like, oh, everyone's gonna eventually die. I'm gonna outlive them. Why bother getting attached? That's why she's like hesitant to get close. Tinashe also was there 70 years ago, but now put an end to the Divine Beast thing. But I think the most important thing about this is the gem at the end. Something about that red gem is really important. 
And these two here, right, the people at the lake, they said that Tinashe is looking for him. I don't know the context of him right now, since everyone that she's been with has been dead, apparently, in the backstory. But maybe there's someone else that we just don't know yet. The fight scenes, though? The fight scenes are fucking good, dude. Don't be fooled by the slow time with the dialogue and a little bit of rom-com because the fight scenes, bro, they can fucking go all out when they need to. But that's it for me, if you're still here. If you did enjoy this reaction, please like the video, check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.